What is up guys, how are you doing? This is Sand here and in today's video I'm going to talk about why I was absent for nearly a year and what is the Iranian University entrance exam which is called Concours. So if you're interested make sure to follow this video till the end. Concours is the Iranian University entrance exam, which the word Concours comes from the French word Concours, which means competition. Simple. <laughs> so, in this competition, students all across the country study for three or two or one year and do their best to just do great in this exam because this exam is the only means of getting into the higher education in Iran and the better rank you get in this exam the better major in a better university you can study so you have to do great in this exam if you are interested in higher education and it is important to you and just looking at the numbers of attendees in this uh, exams it seems that it is important for all the students but not only all of them did not study, but also only 1% or 2% of them study well and just put all the effort that they can. There are three main majors uh, that are Mathematics and Physics, and Natural Studies and Human Studies, I believe. And social Studies, it should be, I don't know, I have no idea about the English word. But yeah, in those three majors, uh, Concours is held. And in my major, which is mathematics and physics, you can study uh, engineering and other technical studies as uh, your higher education. So it has got an uh, approximate number of 120,000 attendees in this exam. But the natural studies, which uh, that can um, allow you to study medicine or anything uh, doctor related, <laughs> uh, it has got nearly approximately and 650,000 attendees, that is a lot. And, uh, but in my major, only the top five to 10,000 or even less people study. So the real competition is between 10,000 people in mathematics and physics major and between the top maybe 50 to, uh, top top 100,000 people in the natural studies major. So everybody does their best. And that is why I stopped doing YouTube. I gave up on all my hobbies and everything that I loved just to study well and do well in my studies. So that is why I was absent on YouTube. And I gave up on my friendships a lot because I couldn't hang out with them, with my dear friends. So. The only job I had to do was studying and not just thinking about a lot of things and that would just have a bad effect and just degrade my rank and my mark on this test. So uh, we studied so hard. I mean, I didn't do my best, but I studied hard, trust me. What do I mean by studying hard? By hard. I mean going to library at 7 a.m. until 10 p.m. and doing nothing there but studying. That is hard. Believe me. We had exams over and over, maybe two or three times a week. And by exams, I mean tests. For example, we had a full test like Concord and it is 235 questions and you got only four hours and 10 minutes for it. You gotta stay in that plus and that is a real challenge for you to just give up on everything, you give up on all your hobbies and still have the motive to sit down on your seat for four hours and 10 minutes and just do good in all the lessons that you've learned. Persian literature, Arabic, religious studies, English language, and then mathematics, and physics, and chemistry. You have to do good all in all of those lessons. So that is a hard challenge for us. It has got some pros and cons, but the cons are just appearing bolder, 
that there was a parliament bill in uh, recent years to eliminate this exam, but they didn't because there was no other way to just choose students from all across the country and just put them in the greatest universities that they got. Because everybody wants to study in the best universities, for example, the Sharif University of Technology, Tehran University, or just Amitabh University of Technology, but everybody is not allowed to study there. So you have to really be good and prove yourself that you're good. So Concour is a competition that you can prove yourself that, yeah, I'm good, I can study well, so I should study in that best university you got. So this is a big challenge for all students across the country. They have to give up on their hobbies, they have to give up on that. everything, their friendships, the things they would like to do, but they cannot because they have to study well, and they don't have the time to study that amount of books. Because you have to study the 10th, 11th, and 12th grade for this exam, all three years are in it. So you have to do it in all three years, in all lessons that I mentioned. So. Uh, the height of books that we had to read was more than two meters, I swear to God, <laughs> and that was a lot. So you have to just arrange your time. I have to study, for example, this is only an exam, I have to study physics for two hours from 10 to 12, then a quarter of free time. After that, I have to study chemistry for two hours, for blah, 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 blah. But that was only an example. and. You have to do your best. Sleep, good, just uh, get away from bad thoughts, eat well, and just have the motive to study without being, without feeling uh, the procrastination, without feeling the anxiety, because there will be a lot of exams that you'll blow, you'll just do bad on them, but you won't, you have to just keep that motive and just talk to yourself, okay, I blew that exam, but I'm going to do well on the next. I got a 50% mark on physics, okay, on the next exam, I'll make it 55%. Okay, I blew my religious studies and I had 10% of mark, okay, I'm going to do better. What was my problem? Just fix it. Just find your problems, fix it, and those are the pros of Concours, I believe. That makes you grow. That makes you a man, in my opinion. That teaches you how to just live your life. Uh, there are a lot of challenges and bumps on the road in your life. You have to just learn, train your mind to how to get along with those, how to react to those challenges, how to do them, how to... Ah, I'm out of words right now. Okay. And the cons of Concours, you have to give up on everything. Not everyone wants to study, so that shouldn't be this much of a challenge. And it is a bit unlogically that you have only 4 hours and 10 minutes to prove yourself and just to choose your future. That is not logical, in my opinion. Those are cons of Concours, so it has some bad things and some good things, and it is being held in Iran for more than 40 years right now and it's doing well. It is uh, the uh, fairest way to choose students from all across the country and there are no uh, cheatings in this exam because it is protected in the best ways they can and the questions are unscrambled on the Concours exam so that the students cannot cheat from each other and those are what my thoughts are about Concours. I hope that it gets a bit better in the future years so students do not have to give up on their hobbies and their uh, teenage years to only study for Concours. But I hope that uh, the universities, the good universities, get better and more so that this option is available for all students across the country, that they don't have to just immigrate to Tehran, immigrate to Isfahan, immigrate to Mashhad, immigrate to Shiraz, so that they don't have to immigrate to those large provinces with high populations, and that keeps the country in a well condition. But right now, no, no way. That is a bad thing, unfortunately. And there is no better way to choose students than concours, so what should they do? And they could not eliminate the concourse, so they didn't. 
But now, I'm back again on YouTube and I had the feeling before the conclude that Oh my god, I have so much to do, I have to learn cooking, I have to learn new language, I have to learn to play the piano back again because I forgot it. I have to learn to do sports again. I have to start my YouTube channel and improve my video creating quality, video making quality, and I hope that this video has got a better quality than all my previous videos. Make sure to let me know in the comment section down below. And just after concours, I was like, oh my god, I'm so bored. I, I have nothing to do right now. But after the time passage, uh, I figured out, no, I should attend classes, and I should just continue doing my hobbies and do whatever I wanted before concours. And I'm glad that I listed them because I didn't remember them. <laughs> yeah, so I'm going to do them back again and I'm back on YouTube and that makes me really happy. I'm going to just post great content for you guys. I hope you enjoy them. And if you're new to my channel, which probably you are, please consider subscribing. If you like this video, make sure to smash that like button. And if you didn't, the other button seems to work okay as well. No big deal. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video. Peace.